Hey everyone, it's Susie and today we are going to 99 Ranch in search for some boba snacks and treats. So let's go see what they have. So I got all of these boba snacks from 99 Ranch. If you don't know what 99 Ranch is, it is uh, an Asian supermarket that's located mostly in California or Washington and some other states as well. And if you don't know what boba is, I will explain it right now. So boba originated in Taiwan and it is like a tapioca ball. Usually it's black and it's made with honey, so it's kind of sweet and has a bit of a chewy texture to it. So it's really good and usually it's in milk tea or some people call it boba milk tea or bubble milk tea. I have a boba pineapple cake, boba milk tea mochi, the famous brown sugar boba ice cream bar. So if you have a 99 ranch near you, be sure to hit it up and try out some boba snacks. So. I got this um, brown sugar boba ice cream bar for about $5.99 on sale. Um, it's made in Taiwan and I've heard a lot of good things about it. So I can't wait to try this one the most. And I think this was about $2 to $3, so not too bad. Also made in Taiwan. And we have our boba pineapple cake, also made in Taiwan. And this was... Two to three dollars as well. So in total, I got it for about thirteen dollars. Okay, so let's try out the brown sugar boba ice cream bar. So this comes in a pack of four. Wow, look at that. You can see all of uh, the milk there and the brown sugar is swirled in with some boba uh, all around. Looks really good. Now let's dig in. That is so good. It's like creamy and at the same time, you taste the brown sugar, but it's not overly sweet, which I like. And the surprising thing I think is that the boba itself is very chewy as if it was freshly made at a boba shop. So, that's good because I thought it was going to be frozen like, you know, ice cream. But no, it, it stays like fresh and chewy, which I really like. To be honest, this would probably be like one of my favorite ice creams. Like, that's how good it is. I would give this a 5 out of 5. It is so, so good. If you go to 99 Ranch, you have to try this. Next up, we have our milk tea boba mochi. So this comes in a six pack. Here's our mochi here, very squishy. And if you don't know what mochi is, it's like a glutinous rice cake kind of. But um, yeah, it's like really soft and usually has filling in it. Oh, I like the flavor a lot. Um, it definitely tastes like Earl Grey milk tea, which is one of my favorites. Um, the only thing is, is that um, the boba in the middle doesn't really like taste like boba that much. Like I can't really tell that boba's in there. I think it's because the 
texture isn't chewy, like chewy and firm like boba. Um, it kind of just goes with how the milk tea texture is, like the filling inside. But overall, the flavor is really good and it's a uh, pretty good mochi. It's really soft too. I would probably give this like a 4 out of 5. Uh, it's just, it's definitely good mochi. I uh, can definitely taste the milk tea flavor. The only thing that disappoints me a little bit is the boba inside. It doesn't really taste like boba. Okay, lastly, we have our boba pineapple cake. Here we go. Comes in individual packages. Cute packaging. Here's our very petite uh, little cake. It's kind of like a shortbread. Now let's take a bite. Hmm. Okay. Um. Hmm. I don't taste the pineapple like at all, which is kind of disappointing. Mm, the other pineapple cakes I've had, at least I could taste the pineapple a little bit. But not in this one. It's kind of sad. So this is what the inside looks like. I At least I taste like that it's kind of chewy. And when you pull it apart, when you're taking a bite, I can tell that it's uh, boba. But honestly, it's not the great the greatest tasting boba snack. Yeah, it's chewy. It's boba. You can kind of taste the boba. Flavor is not that great. I, I personally wouldn't get this again. I would probably give this a 2 out of 5. Um, it doesn't taste like pineapple. And I love pineapple, so it kind of made me sad. <laughs> and um, I mean, at least the boba is like kind of there. So that's why I give it a 2. I really enjoyed trying all these snacks from 99 Ranch. Um, my favorite would maybe be this brown sugar boba ice cream bar. It was so amazing. You have to get it if you're at 99 Ranch. Or if you find it at any store, just, just get it. It's so worth it. Um, I did like the mochi. Uh, tastes like milk tea, definitely. Uh, just didn't really taste the boba flavor too much. Or just like the chewiness of what boba should taste like but overall it was it was a good mochi so I would probably get it again um, unfortunately I didn't really like the boba pineapple cake it didn't taste too great and um, the the buttery taste kind of like stuck to the roof of my uh, mouth so I didn't really like that like after taste after feeling so probably wouldn't get this one again but uh, it was definitely worth trying well, I hope you all enjoyed my video trying all these boba snacks. Uh, if you come across them, definitely uh, check it out. Try it for yourselves. Make sure to hit the like button if you haven't already. Uh, subscribe as well so you get notifications on my new videos. And also comment down below what other foods you'd like to see me try. So follow me on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitch to see live updates on my next mukbang and next videos. And I'd love to interact with all of you guys soon. So yeah, thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed and uh, I'll see you guys later. Bye.